In 2013, a new show slipped on two-hour television screens to a fairly lukewarm reception. A portrayal of 20s. Gang culture in Birmingham, Peaky Blinders drew lackluster reviews, with gripes about wayward accents and the way the series often seemed as much pop video as drama. It seemed Peaky Blinders was a flop unlikely to make it to a second season. But boy did the critics get it wrong. Instead, over three series the buzz has grown around Stephen Knight's tale of the raucous Shelby clan, led by Killian Murphy's Tommy Shelby Gambler, gangster and returning First World War veteran on the make. As it returns for a fourth on BBC Two next week, it comes with an added sense of anticipation that may in part result from the extra fans it has gained from being picked up by Netflix. Indeed, thanks to Netflix, it now has a global following that includes a host of Alice fans Brad Pitt, Tom Cruise, 